Super quick video today going into when we could most likely expect this Frothan LRB. Get this man out of my face. LR Beastless Gohan as well as Tech Ultimate Thicolo should be returning on both Global and JP. I will say that since they arrived together on both versions of the game, I do expect them to return together on both versions of the game. Maybe they could return on JP first, but I honestly don't really see that to be the case. And since we have a really quick video today let's also couple it with a really quick subscriber challenge or like challenge if you are already subscribed and today is super simple you just have to listen to me okay i need you to take your index finger of any hand i don't really care and place it okay on your nose the tip of your nose okay if you right now are not touching your nose you got call lack and you got to subscribe to the channel it is what it is listen Sometimes in life, all you have to do is listen to not get caught lacking. So if you didn't listen today, you got caught lacking, you got to subscribe. But I told you it was easy. All you had to do is listen. I don't know what to tell you. But if you did listen to me, then you can skip today's subscriber challenge. Thank you. Shout out to you for listening. And uh, I think that, you know, the future is looking bright for you. If, of course, you didn't touch your nose, I do think the future is looking bright for you. Because now that you learned that listening is important, maybe you'll implement it in the future. I'm just, I, I love you. Let, let's hop into this video. <laughs> Anyways, um, so when it comes to Beastless Gohan, Fraud Gohan, and Ultimate Thicolo, uh, their release time for both Global and JP is in that late December Dokkan Festival slot. And this is very usual for JP Dokkan. Now, these banners release time wise can be easily compared to banners or characters like the super saiyan 2 goku as well as scr kid boo as you can see they dropped on the 28th of december as well and then same thing for uh you know agl pycon and then tech janemba and then again same thing actually no i, I was gonna pull up some other units here like the super the in, super saiyan 2 goku angel and the vegeta as well but all we really need to do is just check to see when these units returned on JP and then basically line it up and then boom that's basically when these units should be returning as well again very very simple video today so these units and units previously that released in this slot usually return on JP during golden week okay now golden week itself is a celebration um, that takes place towards the end of April into the month of May if you remember last year with the AGL cell and S tier Goku and Gohan unit that was golden week now the beautiful thing is that golden week is shared between both global and JP so since both global and JP have ultimate Gohan and orange Thicolo, that it makes sense that these two units would return to show you last year's case specifically again we had we had goku and gohan's banner and we had cell's banner and on these banners you can see that kid boo was on one of them as well of course as agl pycon and we also again these were previous you know christmas i guess post christmas double contest for jp and then we also had goku here and janemba here we also had one lr in the slot uh, you know on the banners on each banner one lr these are these lrs too i will mention these are um dual dokkan festival lrs not just random lr right like i don't think we're ever going to see like a um you know dokkan festival lr trunks and vegeta on this banner or any one of these banners because they usually split it amongst like the dual dokkan festival so for example the year before this on the gt golden week banners i think we have the five year anniversary at large which again were dual dokkan festival banners and guess what these two were dual dokkan festivals and of course are only one lr each so i could definitely see this year for golden week piccolo being on one and gohan being on another again this is late April, so literally four-ish months from now, a little bit, a little bit less than four-ish months from now. But again, uh, it should be very, very quick. I don't think Piccolo will still be the best unit in the game by that time, but he's still going to be very, very good. So you can look forward to him releasing, or I guess returning in April. If he doesn't return in April, though, I mean, I maybe Tanabata, but I, I don't, I don't know because at that point. We'd have to see what the anniversary for JP gives. If the anniversary for JP doesn't have Gohan and Piccolo, then I don't think Global's anniversary will have that, which means that we could possibly see them return during the worldwide celebration. So I would say April now for Golden Week or worldwide celebration for both Global and JP. You let me know what you think. Hopefully you enjoyed this relatively quick video and I will see you in the next one. Take care and peace.